So, to collect this data, I manually went through each episode and counted the time the characters were on screen. It took ages, but I think the information is interesting. The criteria that I used to be included in the bar chart was a character must have appeared in at least two episodes and have a combined appearance time of more than four minutes. This left a few characters who had so little screen time that I didn't see the point in including them in the chart. You can see them on screen now. Looking at the data, it's no surprise that Ava was on screen for the longest amount of time. I feel that a lot of the other timings look wrong because Ava's screen time numbers were so great. I am surprised at how little Mary was shown though. It really felt like she was visible for much more time especially during the second half of the season. I also kind of felt that the Warrior Nun story was about her journey after Shannon passed away as well as Ava's. Beatrice, again, was not shown much during the first half of the season, but was much more visible during the second. Father Vincent and Lilith felt about right in the scheme of things in relation to the other characters. I was shocked at JC though. I really felt that he was a waste of a character. He didn't really add anything to the story and he had more screen time than Gillian Salvius, which just seems weird to me. I really liked Sister Camilla as a character. It is a shame she was not seen as much as the other nuns, but I think her role was a little bit of comic relief and just niceness, and maybe it would have spoilt her character if we saw her more. I'm not sure. Cardinal Duetti felt about right in screen time terms, and Mother Superior obviously picked up a bit in the last couple of episodes. I think she'll have a bit much uh, bigger role in season two. Christian Schaefer was another role that I felt uh, they could have done more with. He felt very lacklustre. Adriel was in a few clips in the early episodes, but obviously had a huge role in the last one, which raised his numbers. Sister Frances obviously appeared in the first few episodes, but then uh, met her demise in episode four, so she did not appear again. It is possible she could appear next season in flashbacks, though. Um, I can see that this might happen to tell more of Ava's backstory. We still don't know anything about her father, so we may see more about that and more with Sister Francis. Then we go to Chanel and further down, Randall and Zori. I thought that they were completely pointless and brought nothing to the story. Uh, JC could have been adjusted to fill their roles and make much better use of him. I'm amazed that Chanel had uh, more screen time than Michael Salvius, especially considering how important his role is to the show. Although Sister Shannon didn't appear much, her scenes were quite long. Um, I don't think we will see her next season, as I really felt that her character's journey seems to be complete now, um, and the baton has sort of been completely handed over to Ava. But we'll see. But I don't think we will. Maybe we might see more uh, warrior nuns, different warrior nuns from history. That's possible, um, and that could actually add to the story quite a lot. Um, and I suppose Shannon could... Um, could be an introduction to those nuns. She might be the guide, perhaps. Um, so yeah, we'll see. There's certainly um, scope, but um, we'll see what happens. I was also surprised that Wraith Demons appeared more than the Tarasks, but I counted the humans who had black eyes as a Wraith Demon. So the fight that Ava had in the Butchers in Episode 6 is what brought their numbers up. So now that the nuns have come together at the end as a cohesive team, can't say that word, cohesive team, um, I would expect all of their screen times to increase in the second season, and I think the figures will reflect that. I also think that Mother Superior will take on the role that Father Vincent had during the first season, so her screen time will dramatically increase as well. I really enjoyed the first season of Warrior Nun, Looking forward to watching the second when it does eventually come out. 
Um, it could be, well, it's going to be late 2021 at the earliest. I suspect it'll be 2022, uh, realistically, when filming can start again. Really hope you liked this video. Let me know what you thought about it in the comments below. Watch out for other videos on my channel. Be seeing you.